This is the third of the three pines we're going to look at. This is lodgepole pine, Pinus contorta. And that Latin name maybe suggests a little bit about its growth form. It tends to be quite crooked, but it's one of these tree species that will survive in the most inhospitable uh, of situations. It will deal with extreme exposure, uh, high rainfall, very thin, poor quality soils. Planted quite a bit in the north of Scotland in particular. Uh, in terms of physical appearance and its characteristics, it's a split between Corsican pine and Scots pine that we've seen already. It has the short paired needles of Scots pine, but it has the colour of the Corsican pine. It has this astroturf green colour of, uh, uh, of the Corsican pine. Um, almost a tree of last resort. It will deal with the most extreme sites and it will produce relatively low volumes of quite, quite uh, moderate quality timber. So if you want to grow material on a tough site for potentially for biomass or for chipwood for making panel boards out of, Pinus contorta lodgepole pine will do the job for you but uh, it usually is only planted on the most extreme sites.